what we've got here is sugar beet and of course this is the same crop that is used to produce table sugar but it also has some utility as a cover crop now one of the drawbacks of sugar beets is that they they just are don't have a lot of seedling vigor they're not very uh, competitive against weeds they tend to get overshadowed in a mix where they really show up well is in a monoculture or with some other slow growing plants um, where sugar beets really shine is a couple situations one is when you have salty soil sugar beets grow on soil too salty for any other plant pretty much they also uh, have you know a nice tap root that can open up holes allow some better drainage if you're trying to remediate a, a salty soil or, or a sodic soil. Um, the other benefit that sugar beets really have, of course, highly palatable grazing plant, but for deer food plots, this is probably the single most palatable plant there is to deer. Deer love sugar beets, and I know people that have planted seven acre food plots of sugar beets, and the deer have come in and annihilated the entire plot. Um, very, very palatable plant to deer, and that's really honestly where we sell most of our sugar beets, is for people who want highly attractive deer plots.